Hi Arnabies, it's me, Crochet B, back again for another installment of Sandy and Angie's uh, Christmas is Terrific Gift Extravaganza. Gift Exchange, 25 days. I wanted her to say Christmas is terrific, let's get gift specific, but she didn't think she'd be able to say all that three times twice. So, Okay, so we're going to get another one done. I'm going to do a couple at a time here while we're waiting for Sandy's voice to come back. Uh, assuming it will. Um, um, just coffee in the cup today because I have to take care of Sandy, so we can't have any whiskey today. So we're going to uh, get on with the program here. I think I get what we're doing. So once again, we have our, our Advent calendar counting down till Christmas. And uh, last time we got a lovely Kit Kat bar. And now we are looking for the number three, which is right in the middle. So we'll pop this. I'm really hoping for a peanut butter cup. But it looks like another Kit Kat bar. So I'm wondering if this is all Kit Kat bars. Oh, no, there's the Smarties Kit Kat Arrow and... Anyway, so now we have two of those to eat later. And then Bailey is here. Bailey. Sniffing around already for Bailey's advent calendar of dog delights as well and number three is right up at the top here apparently it's impervious to man oh there we go and we are pulling out mm. oh lots of little sort of kibbly bits little snackies for her so I'm sure she's already coming over here. She's almost in my lap now. Come on. Come on. We'll see if uh, these pass the mustard. Okay, I got it open here. And come on. Hopefully it's here. Okay. All right. This will keep her going for a bit. So I'll just put these down over here for her. And she can just have a party. Go to town. So this is a good idea. We're just uh, getting them ones for Bailey. And it kind of keeps her out of the way while we're working here too. Okay. So now for the gift opening today. I did not know this. But Angela actually got one for me. <laughs> so thanks, Ange. Um... It feels like it might be a, a can of beans or something. I'm not sure what it is. Oh, I uh oh. I think I'm about to get mugged. Let's just see. It feels there's a handle. It feels very mug like. So. Oh, look at how Christmassy is that. Nice. So it's got little reindeers on. It's a beautiful blue. And it's like a hot mug for you to put your tea or coffee in. And you've got the little uh, little thing here for drinking before you can take this when you're uh, when you're driving. Which I can only, my van will only start if I have a coffee in my right hand while I turn the key. And then I often drive doing this all day long as I'm working in between jobs, as Sandy knows, because it drives her crazy. So thank you so much, Angela. That's really nice of you. I didn't know I was going to get anything out of this. This is nice. I thought I was working for free. but Okay, so I will I will put my next cup of coffee in this and think of you while I'm drinking it. And so, oh, Sandy, Sandy would like me to open one for her as well. So I'll open this little guy. They all feel squishy like yarn. So, apparently I found out I'm getting Sandy a ginormous box of yarn for Christmas this year. I didn't even know. She uh, went on to Black Friday and basically bought all of Black Friday. So this is, oh, it's not a ball of yarn. It's a pink something or other in bubble wrap. Oh, it's a little cup. Oh, look at it. 
There's nothing really in it. It's, it's like a Christmas ornament that you hang from the tree. <laughs> it's like a little mug. Well, it's got the S for Sandy, right? I'm assuming. And, uh, okay, well, here, we'll just, we'll, we'll test it out. I'm not a um, pattern tester, but I might be an official ornament tester. So we will put that on there. And there we go. Well, it's kind of hidden by the... There we go. How about that? Look, it works! Yay! And then here, we'll, we'll put this one up here. Yeah, no. Um... Okay, so I guess we're now at the uh, the trivia question. Oh, yes, yesterday's trivia question. So the trivia question was, and this is one that I did not know, what is the name of Rudolph's son? So the answer is Robbie the Reindeer. So I don't know how many of you got that right, but... We will put the winner down below. Sandy will do her magic editing. And so this is kind of a funny one. I actually guessed wrong on this uh, because, um, anyway, I guessed wrong. I was thinking of a more recent example of this. but And the, the question is, in 1979, which by the year, was that was the year I graduated high school, Sandy was nine. <laughs> so the time goes, I was ten. Um, women's groups, politicians, and seniors' organizations protested at a protest. They protested which specific Christmas song? So in 1979, women's groups, politicians, and seniors' organizations protested which Christmas song? Okay, so you think all this PC stuff is a modern phenomenon. Apparently, it was went back as far as 1979. So, uh, put your answers down below in the comments, and we will pick a winner, like we have for the last two. And we'll tell you that in the next video. So, that's two down for Sandy. I'm going to do a couple of these at a time while we wait. Give her a couple of days to see kind of how she's doing, because I know that you'd much rather have her than me. And so would I. Um, this is her channel, not my channel. But she's going to do a Tales from the Carpet Trail for me to make up for this. So, uh, anyway. Okay, so thanks for joining us for the next one. Merry Christmas, guys, coming up. I hope you're getting all ready for the big day. Uh, we actually have snow here. So, I was out in the snow today. Uh, and uh, our street is a street that is a very much a side street that often doesn't get a lot of attention from the city. So... They did come and plow the initial snowfall, but they left about a two-inch layer of ice on the road. So we're having lots of fun looking out our window, watching everybody being stuck, trying to get out of our road or coming home and going sideways. Well, my van seems to be able to get through anything. Not everybody's quite so lucky. So anyway, we'll uh, hopefully see Sandy in the next one. And if not, I'll see you guys soon. Bye for now.